All right. I think we are getting close to something. Possibly the final challenge. Tasta in the heart of something something vibe. And maybe you have a vibe to click on those like and subscribe buttons if you are enjoying this adventure. I really hope you are. And of course, comments are welcome as well. Let's see. For some reason he... Right. They wouldn't have it. Goodbye, sir. Give me some of that. Okay. Guess we're just pushing forward. Feels like a boss arena. I think you might be losing this one. You're on a roll, nice shot. Activate something to get over? Or could we actually get over? We could. Any more? Nope. Yeah, I need some of that. Spock. What are you doing, Spock? Spock, buddy. Okay. Once again, he decided to do his own thing. Let's see if this can lure him over. We're running out of time. Sent to the third level, and we have sent to the mothership core. Sounds very final. I wonder if that's another boss area. Yeah. 
think about that. Okay. <laughs> I like that he can just arrogantly say, Nah, you know what, I don't want to help out. You do everything, I'll show up eventually. Perhaps I'm in a good mood. Over here! As far as I could tell, it wasn't exactly doing anything. Yeah. Of worth or of more worth <laughs> than we are doing right now. But he is Vulcan, they think differently, we know that. We're gonna show up now. I was hoping he would show up now. Is he here? We kind of need him to hack this, I think. Or maybe not. Apparently not. We're in. Thanks for the help. We have found the device. What the hell are they doing to her? I believe the Gorn are somehow forcing her to operate the Helios device. We need to get her out of there. As long as the Helios device is operational, we will be unable to beam out. And we've got to take it out. We will need to overload those plasma transducers first. Sounds good. What's a plasma transducer? Those pylons. Why didn't you just say that? Done, Captain. I see it. This is a big place. I 
Let's get a buzz on. Captain, we can now disable the Helios device. With pleasure. around tomorrow is connected to the Gorn leader. So we gotta take him out to get to tomorrow. It appears so. Fine by me. Wow. You know what? It's a little hard to actually see him. Mr. Scott. Hang on, I'm coming to help! Work it, son! Tamar, I will take care of their leader. Are you sure? Yes. As I believe you would say, I have a score to set. Then get to it. <laughs> Scotty, get ready to beam us out on my mark. Captain, I have a lock on all three of you. Do it now. Captain, looks like there's a whole other fleet of bad guys coming right through that second rep. Don't they ever give up? Status of our engines. They're barely holding on, but they should be able to get us out of here. Good work, Mr. Scott. Sulu, full impulse, get us through that rep. Okay. <laughs> End of the game, I guess. Captain's log supplemental. The Federation is safe from the Gorn. For now. I'm starting to wonder if there's anything Spock and I can't do when we work together. It seems that the older Spock was right. Our partnership, our friendship, really is something special. Our mission would not have succeeded if not for the exemplary performance of my crew. They are all truly deserving of commendations for this one. I have recommended to both Starfleet and the Vulcan High Council that Tamar be awarded honors for bravery. I am happy to report that she will be allowed to continue her work in the rebuilding of New Vulcan. I know that she still blames herself for what happened, but hopefully, one day, she will realize that it was Commodore Daniels who deserves the blame for the Gorn invasion. We've just been given new orders by Admiral Pike to travel to the planet Nibiru to help in some sort of humanitarian mission. Hopefully, this mission will include way less Gorn than the last one. Kirk out.
All right, so that was better. We got a little cutscene at the end tying it all together with the new movies, but there we have it. Star Trek 2013 has been beaten and I hope you all had as much fun as I had, because I actually had quite a bit of fun playing through this, yeah, you know, flawed game. There's a lot of jank in there, but I think the fact that I enjoyed the movies helped a lot. Thank you all so much for following along in this Star Trek adventure from 2013. This game was a lot more fun than I thought. I hope you had a good time watching the adventure alongside with me. And if you did, why not hit those like and subscribe buttons and I'll see you again in future videos. Bye for now.